Baseball has been a tradition for many years at Wayne Hills High School. The 2013 JV team under coach Tom Dutch has improved their record from under 500. Their team has experienced some pleasant surprises this year. When asked about these surprises, the players all had different opinions. Well, we've been hitting the ball pretty good this year. We got Nick Berger and Chris Phillips, both with one of the highest batting averages on the team. And last year we weren't very well known for hitting the ball very hard. So that's a pr pretty good positive for this year. You know, I was surprised uh, how good we actually did. thought we wouldn't go under 500, but we actually finished at 500 exactly. And uh, it was a pretty good season overall. As Luke Gilmore and Nick Berger said, hitting has been a big part of the team's success during the 500 season. However, the team believes they could have had a more successful second half of the season. Yeah, I think we're pretty good, but we could be a little better. We, we've been hitting well, we've been fielding, we made a few errors here and there. We should have won more than we lost, but you, can, you, can you can't change anything about it. Uh, we started off better in the beginning half, and then towards the end we sort of got sloppy, so we didn't win as much. So, I guess, yeah, we started off better, but as the season went on, we got worse. Even though they wish the team could have played a better second half of the season, they still finished strong. When asked about their personal strengths and weaknesses, the players were very honest about themselves. I feel like one of my personal strengths as a catcher would probably be blocking the ball, keeping the ball in front of me. It's probably what I do best as my catching abilities. Personal weaknesses, um, this year I've been doing pretty good hitting, but I feel like I could do a lot better. Probably hit the ball a lot harder and hit it into the gaps, hopefully get some doubles instead of singles. Well, as a player, when I make a mistake, I don't really like get too mad about it, kind of like put it back, kind of forget about it and think about the next play and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Some of my weaknesses are uh, my fielding could have been a little better, you know, I had a couple nice plays but I made some errors when uh, when a play needed to be made when there's runners on the, when there's runners on the base and uh, if I improved that I probably would have done pretty good this season and had a better overall season. The modest players say they can have an even better season next year despite their weaknesses. The players say the next year they will be making a comeback with some new additions from the freshman team and will be looking for championships. Next season I expect the team to play pretty well. I mean we're getting some new additions to the team such as some of the kids from the freshman team that are pretty well, pretty good so I'm thinking we're going to get a lot better next year. I think we'll be alright. We'll win more games than we did this season. We'll hit better. We'll do better hopefully. Robbie Testino and Ezra Ortega both stated that next year, the team will be making a grand comeback. Even though making this comeback will take hard work and effort, the team will still have a lot of fun. best part about this team is probably the fun. In the locker room, we like to mess around with each other. We always have a bunch of jokes going around, and it's just fun to be around the team. best part about this team is that, you know, we're serious when we need to be serious, but when we're not. It's fun. We actually we enjoy it, and we actually make it, make it a good time. and. Uh, you know, some some teams are too serious and they take everything like life or like a life or death situation. But uh, here we have fun and make it a good time. So as you can see, the Wayne Hills JV baseball team is a great experience for all who take part. The players and coaches had a great time working together this season and are looking forward to a championship next year.